if you're among those circle of persons that have nothing doing at all nothing going on at all i think it's wrong for you to say i cannot do it you should change to how can i do it you need to key into opportunities that are around you you might not have that money to set up a business let's say for instance that i do not have the money to set up a shop a very nice outlet where people can come and patronize whatever i choose to do okay i don't even have money to pay the rent so where do i start from even if i decide to start from my house how do I get the equipment that are necessary for me to start up this business? You don't have these things. What do you have? If you are listening to me, it means that you have a cell phone and you are always online following all the gossip blogs. Whatever that is going on online, uh -uh. you know it, you are number one to know. But you are not making money from it. It's called a smartphone for a reason. Check around you, there are opportunities flying around. If you get started now, in two three years three months sometimes depending on the energy you put in because your energy is very important what you don't know is that i see people you go to somewhere they pay you let's say they pay you thirty thousand naira for instance and you walk around the clock sometimes they tell you we are starting by eight we are closing by five and you get started before you know it you are going to work by seven because they need you urgently there and then sometimes we are closing by nine that's somebody's work they are paying you salary 30,000. Now, when it comes to do your own business, building something that will be beneficial for you that nobody's hacking, you see, better saying, I can't do it. I can't do it. But if it's another person's work, you will slave yourself without here because you don't have choice. And who told you that people that are doing it don't have fears? Who told you? Who told you that me, I don't have fear that I might not succeed, that I might fail, that this might not work? Whatever it is, you don't you don't determine your future, but you determine your habits. And this habit, however you were able to do it, bit by bit, bit by bit, it compounds to success. Okay, so or failure, depending on the habits you are building. Maybe your habit is to sleep all the time. Maybe your habit is to hang out all the time with friends that are not of value. Maybe your habit is to um, invest in yourself. When I talk about investing in yourself, investing is gaining more knowledge. Okay, all these things compound with time. They are habits. Okay, and these are the things that shape your future. Now, let's say you want to get started, but it's not really easy for you. Start from somewhere. Go online. There is nothing you cannot Google now. Go to Google. Go to YouTube. Search on that particular aspect of business you've decided to start. Research. Have a mentor. You know why it's good to have a mentor. I want to use the example of a printing press. If I decide to open a printing press today, and I have zero knowledge on what that printing press is all about, I'm likely to fail because I don't know where to get wholesale papers will sell generally equipment or gadget right? that's the number one way to lose money because i don't have the knowledge of what to do so maybe i might go to this particular person and this person will be selling far more costlier than i would i would have gotten it if i actually have a knowledge of where it's cheaper do you understand now another thing is i don't have know somebody that might come to repair my printer do this or all that i don't know how much to charge people when they come to me, please can you produce this for me? At that starting stage, I might make lots and lots of mistakes. But if you have a mentor in that particular field, it becomes easier. Why? Your mentor must have passed through that mistake you're about to pass through. Whatever that mentor tells you to do or what they do, implement it. I mean, there is somebody in that field. Nothing is new under the sun anyway. So there is somebody in that field already that is doing well in that particular business. In that particular thing you want to do so get close to the person get rid of your ego get rid of your pride you have something to achieve you have something to gain i mean your target is to make money and be successful depending on whatever level of satisfaction you want for yourself maybe it's not actually to make money you want to be famous <laughs> or whatever you want to do so i believe that with this it's of you to just channel your effort strictly on following people on social media and you don't have anything doing you have to get up make use of your smartphone look for something to do online either as your main business or as a side hustle so when we look back a few years time to come we say ah oh, we actually got started and yes the result is finally here Ta -da! 
I believe you have gained value from this video you just watched right now and your mind might be juggling on what to do, where to get started immediately or you have something to do but you need a side hustle. Here is a video. <laughs> I click on it, watch it and guess what? This is something that both of us are already into but you might not be making money from it. Subscribe to my channel. Oh yeah. Click, click. See me where my picture is showing. <laughs> Click on it right away because I'll be uploading videos that will be of great value and of great help to you to grow financially. It's very important now. Eh? Share this video, get people to like it, comment, turn up your notification button so that anytime I upload, you'll be the first person to know about it.